to my channel where we live life healthy. Today I'll be showing you how I'm going to make my date and oat muffin. Yes, and little cupcakes. So the ingredients I'll be needed today will be two cups of oat flour, five tablespoons of Greek yogurt, um, one tablespoon of baking soda, two eggs, some chopped dates, a pinch of salt, uh, vanilla essence, maybe a tablespoon of that will do, and book of coconut oil. So let's jump right in. So um, I'll start by putting the ingredients. Uh, I'll go with two eggs first. Two eggs. Uh, I'm trying to put in the wet ingredients. So I need five tablespoons of yogurt. This is almost finished so I just want to finish it before I go to the new one. So. Adding the dates and then um, vanilla essence, the most finished, so that's about one teaspoon. And um, try and mix the wet ingredients together. Then don't forget the olive and the coconut oil as a half a cup and um, the flour um, that's coconut flour about half a tablespoon of oat flour so I'm just gonna add it in Need a pinch of salt to go in. So a pinch of salt. That's it. And then uh, some of this sweetener. I'll go with about three teaspoons tablespoons. This is a sweetener, you could use sugar. If you want to, but I just prefer to use sweetener for health reasons. So, so now you start to mix. You got to do that. So while we're mixing, get that. Uh, I've just kind of added one more egg because I was supposed to use banana. Because I have sweet now, I really don't want too many sweet things. And the date is very sweet, you know. So for moist, I added one more egg. So we have three eggs in this uh, in this recipe now. Three eggs, right? So what's been going on, people? The gates are open and people are going now. Now you can go to the shop freely. You can go visit neighbors and I guess... That is so good with our mental health. I remember the last um, couple of weeks ago, I did um, a video on mental health, how to improve your mental health and uh, how to improve your mental health and boost your, in, uh, your immune, boost your mood, you know? So, and for me, for me, I found something new. I found a new hobby, which was gardening. I got 
small new plants which I planted in the past they'll die on me but this time around I took time was intentional so sometimes when you do things intentionally you see the result for me I said okay I'm gonna feed I learned better ways of doing things you know I just didn't feed the water I got their own special feed and I fed them every other day uh, or two days every other two days like every other day or two days interval and my flowers are growing and guess what my rose plant when i got that was just green plants like no petals no flowers but the first day i saw a rose petal i was so so glad so anyway let's go back to the cake <laughs> so here we go so i'm putting i'm making cupcakes or like cup muffins so for me i love color so I'm just going to, the oven is on, so I'm just going to go the tray for six, for twelve. So I need to pull my glasses. Okay, they're really so close and they're stuck together. So that's, um, so I'm going to go with white. So sometimes I know it's it's like when you're on a healthy lifestyle, sometimes you feel you're missing a lot, you know. So for me, I like my food and um, I know it's hard. It's not really hard to stay my, um, healthy, it's just your mindset, you know. So it's something you do intentionally, but sometimes it could be boring because you want to have cake and you feel you can't have it. So this muffin, when you start making your own muffin, you're not gonna feel like going to buy cake, you know. So it's gonna give the same taste. The only difference is you're using you're not using flour, you're using old flour, which is so so healthy. You know, it's good for the heart. It's um, it helps with um, to lower your cholesterol. And then, what better way to have fun and have snacks in a healthy way as well, you know? So. They're so close together, like okay. So it looks double to me. I think it's one. So yeah, today we're gonna make cupcake cup muffins, cupcake muffins. In you know, so now it's time to mix a bit. Sometimes you leave it to sit for like a um, few minutes, leave it to rest. So while I was getting that um, cupcakes um, arranged, I think that rested. So I'm now going to plate them. Um, I have to now scoop them out. So here we go. I'm going to make sure every, every cup gets a um, date. You know, sometimes for me, I'm a sweet tooth, so I believe there are other people that are like me too, you know, so, but hey, you can still have fun and still live a healthy life, you know, just all you need to do is look for stop, substitute alternatives, you know. If you're diabetic as well, this is so good because it's um, oat flour, oat is good for lowering your blood sugar, it's good for for heart, it's good to flush out um, cholesterol from your body. That's the oat, um, you know, and um, loads and loads of benefits. And the date is a sweetener as well as a natural sweetener. Is a, is a fruit, a piece of um, fruit which I chopped into bits. They're called dates. They're really nice, but very sweet, you know. So. We're back. See the muffin, date oat muffin. It's going into the oven now. So we just like to cook. Yeah, about three. I leave it on 180 degrees, 180 to 200. 
for my oven is extra hot you know so you have to go buy your own oven you know just keep checking so we'll leave this for a bit so voila here we have our cupcakes date and old muffin so why don't you come have a cup of tea with me you can see my nicely decorated date and oat muffin so I'm just going to sit there and have a cup of tea like this wow yum 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 this looks heavenly whoa Don't you go get your ingredients and make some of this date and oat muffin. Mm. Mm. So if you're new to this channel, give it a thumbs up, subscribe and share with friends and family. For more and new recipes, click on your notification bell whenever I make new videos that will alert you videos are out so have a lovely day till i see you again next week bye, -bye.